Okay, so we're looking at question 33 from chapter 9, and it says a wagon wheel is constructed as shown in the figure. And you can see that wagon wheel there. Um, the radius of the wheel is 0.3 meters, and the rim has a mass of 1.4 kilograms. Each of the eight spokes that lie on the diameter are 0.3 meters long and have a mass of 0.28 kilograms. What is the moment of inertia of the wheel about an axis through the center and uh, perpendicular to the plane of the wheel? I'm gonna sneeze. Sorry. Okay. So the radius is 0.3 meters, the mass of the wheel is 1.4 kilograms, and then the little end is the... Man, I'm gonna really sneeze. Sorry. And um, the little m is the mass of the spokes, 0.28 kilograms, and so we get the moment of or inertia is equal to mass times um, length squared, and so we're going to do the mass of the spokes here, and so that's going to equal, um, the equation we're going to use is one-third, so inertia of the spokes is equal to one-third times the little m, um, mass of the spokes times the length squared. So we use this equation down here, so we did 0.3 times, uh, sorry, 0.3 squared multiplied by 1.4 kilograms, which is the mass of the whole thing, plus um, 8 thirds times 0.28 um, kilograms. So this is the mass of the spoke. And so this gives us the, the moment of inertia, which ends up being uh, 0.193 kilograms times meters squared.